7 o'clock, 47 degrees. Why do girls wear thong? I just, I was watching Juke Squad recently, and the girls that run with them, most of them wear the thong. I mean, their butt is right there. It's their butt is hanging out. Is, is the girl with her butt, bare butt, okay? What is, what is their thinking? I, I really, I don't understand. I mean, I don't, <laughs> I don't, <laughs> I don't think I would go around with my ass hanging out, some, somehow covering up my wiener and just have my ass hanging out. That's what they're doing. What are they trying to accomplish? Do they get insulted when you look at it? Or is that what they want you to do? Or are they trying to attract a mate? Or they're trying to be funny? Do they think it's sexy? Uh, partially covered up is much more sexy, by the way. Uh, uh, I don't get it. I, I, don't, I don't know what my lesson was. It was yesterday. But I was going up to pay at the gas station and a girl got in front of me and she was a young girl probably about 20 ish I don't know <clears throat> walked up the counter and so I'm right behind her right and she got looks like she'd never been out in the sun in her life her legs look like you know like a turkey when you pull the plastic off before you get ready to put it in the oven her legs were that like white and then she had on these little it, I don't know what it was uh, underwear Form-fitting, I mean, it was their ass. I mean, it was like you could have pulled those off and it had been the same. It was just like almost a flesh tone pant. Yeah, it's a boot. And it was just like her ass. I mean, there was nothing left to imagination whatsoever at all. It was like standing behind somebody who had no pants on. Now, what, what, <laughs> first of all, she doesn't get out in the sun, that's for sure. Was she a prisoner? I should have asked her if she was being, a, if she was being trafficked. I didn't, I didn't think of that, or I would have. These days, it's just ask them, are you okay? Are you being trafficked? Have you been kidnapped? If they look at you like you're an idiot, then great, fine. But if they might say, yes, I am. And then you go, please. So anyway, I would just like to know what is what is their thinking? What are they thinking? What are they trying to accomplish by having their ass hanging out? Someone, please educate me in the comments. Have no trolls, please. I won't read your shit. Anyway, that was on my mind. Koopy. Cali wants some cheese, apparently. Uh, fat boy. Fat boy Koopy. Sorry, let me play names. You're just a little tubby. It's funny, we have a motion light in our hallway because it's dark in our hallway. And what do you want? Ooh, yeah, man. And uh, the dog, I put the dog bowl in the hallway. You want more? Jesus. All right. You guys are not going to have nothing left for the end of the walk. That's all right, I guess. Good for you. Hold on. There you go. Okay. Uh, anyway, we, I put the dog bowl in the hallway because the rats were coming in. To, uh, and eating the dog food, which was... Last time, the light in the hallway kept coming on. I looked up and there was a rat eating out of the dog bowl. Apparently not afraid of the light. So I put a trap out and caught him and released him to the park. So anyway, but it was, I said, that light kept going on, oh, no, oh shit, I got another rat. So I raised my head up and I looked and it was one of our cats. 
looking at me like, oh, busted. He, he, she was eating the dog food. So how do our animals stay so fat? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing. But we're trying. We used to leave the food out 24-7, dry food, and nobody had a problem. Then we, Charlie got diabetes, and so we started just feeding them twice a day, and now they, if you put dry out, they kind of, I think they overeat. So I don't know. What are you gonna do? Diet food don't work, trust me. And it's way expensive. Of course, that's why the vet gives you the, you know, the little V in the dog's arm to give him the dia and then the word beaties in the first place because it's a money maker. Who knows what else they give them, you know? Who knows what else they give them? Who knows what else they give them? Do the vets know this? Probably. Maybe not, but probably. Why do you think they're so insistent you have that before they even look at your dog or cat and you and you have no you you, you have no choice. So anyway. And the same for us. Same for us, folks. Think about it. Think about it. Why are so many paths? For no reason. Honey Golden with Scott, whatever. I don't, Scott's obnoxious, but she was on there, I think it was that one hour and 18 minutes, if I had to guess, that last show with, she did with him. Uh, she tells you why. The guy wrote in and asked why his child passed in the middle of the night. And she made it quite clear what it was. So, anyway. C H and then A N C E saying these and then W O and then R D S Well, you gotta do something, right? You know that's what they say. They say the good guys are in control of everything, but boy sure don't look like it, does it? Sure don't look like it. Like Ishmael Perez was talking today about, was it him? Yeah, he said during the latest thing in Florida, <clears throat> what under the cover of the winds and the rain, they were clearing out uh, under, uh, can I say diz? And then the word knee, and then the, the word world, the badness under there. Well, I thought that was already done. I heard that was done, 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 done. Gene Decode said that's all done. All the underground stuff is done. Yet, I keep hearing some of the last holdouts of the underground stuff, like is, and then the word real. Like, real bad shit under there. It's like, what? <clears throat> so at times, I think I'm just being... <coughs> We're just being fooled by the bad guys who are telling us, oh, it's all handled. It's okay. Just sit back and eat your popcorn. It's cool. While they finally shut the door. But I don't know. What can I do? There's nothing I can do about it. Nothing I can do. I got one nine millimeter. I don't think that'll...
do a whole lot of damage. <clears throat> so anyway, Tuesday, I think it's Tuesday, and uh, right Kelly, right, right, you ate, you ate the cheese already, so I guess all you can do is Wait to see what's going to happen. If they have the contest November and then the, the number five, I'm going to not be happy. But if they have it, then I guess you just... Ooh, what'd she take off for? I don't know. What are you going to do? Koopy? Where's Ollie? Damn, he was right here. Oliver! Ollie! Oliver! <clears throat> Ollie! There he is. What are you doing? What are you doing? You trying to worry me? Everything worries me. And fear is my last enemy. Good luck with that, right? <clears throat> Going on. Not much I can tell you other than I still believe it's all happening. And, uh, if they have the contest in next month, I'm going to be very upset. <coughs> and I'll probably just start talking about golf or something. Oh man, uh, NPC, you know how the non-playing characters, they just have a program. I think I met my first pure one at the grocery store. I, I told her something about silver three times. And she's like, just keeps referring back to her conversation about whatever. <laughs> the register or something. Completely could not understand what the words that were coming out of my mouth. I have got a program about groceries. I talk about groceries. I only talk about groceries. It was just, it was really weird. <sighs> So anyway, stay away from the NPCs. <sighs>